wretch like me. I once was lost, but now I'm found. Was blind, but now I see. Powerful word. Now I'm going to just educate you very, uh, just very quickly. On the piano, you have white keys and black keys. And that song can actually be played on all the black keys. Now, for those of you who can't see this, this black, we have two black keys and three black keys. So how much is that? Two plus three. Five. And five is actually linked to the number of grace. So the, when he wrote that song, he was talking about amazing grace of God. Right? The grace, the unmerited favor of God, his love. And he can be played on all those notes. So it's no coincidence that it has those notes on the piano. Now I found that this grace is timeless and this grace is also stylless. So one of these days, you know, I like to give stories for those of you who know me, right? So one of these days I was just meditating and thinking about that grace. I'm like, God, your grace is timeless, right? Because we don't even deserve it. It's timeless. And in music, it's actually stylus. So his grace is timeless. And, his, and the mu- in music, his grace is stylus. So I was listening, or I was looking at some of the earlier music. So in the earlier music, you know, I was around in those medieval times and nights and so forth. But they would do a lot of these hums. I don't know what they are do. But if I was in that style, I'm like, okay, that's grace is timeless. And... Grace is also stylus, so if I did it in that style, it'd be like this. Sounds like a bagpipe almost, doesn't it? <laughs> well, not an instrument. But if I if I went to another time, I was hearing another song. Now. I don't necessarily agree with all the song, but I heard, and those of you who heard this last time, it went like this, right? Now I heard, okay, time, grace is stylus. I heard I said because grace is stylus right grace is timeless and stylus so those of you I was growing in the 1970s well those of you that grew up in the 60s I would hear this stuff in the 60s at least I was told or I did hear it and you know styles like right is that 60s okay so if I grew up in the 60s I would hear this Let's say grew up in uh, yeah, Bach and Mozart times and so forth. So they would have maybe songs like. So I'm like, grace is timeless. Grace is stylus. So if I was in that era, I'd do that song like this. Now, some of my background, very quickly, is I'm Canadian, proud to be Can- Canadian, but I'm also proud to have a Jamaican background. So if I was in Jamaica, they would probably do it like, like this. Grace is timeless and his grace is stylus. So if I grew up in another era, I think maybe around the 
70s now, you'd hear a song that would sound like this. Now, I said, no, that style is timeless, it's... Talking about my God, <laughs> or 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 I have a all right. So I would have a maybe another era. You'd hear something like now, but I would hear it like this. Maybe you guys have heard a song that sounds like this. Um, I think I heard the piano or something like that. So I say, grace is timeless. Grace is stylus. So this one, I just say, uh, I used to like a particular piano player, he's a Canadian, his name was Oscar Peterson. Now he'll play songs that sound like this. Amazing grace is timeless and it's stylish. Amen. <laughs>